the Center for International Business Studies has been here at Texas A&M in the Mays Business School, I think probably just about as long as the Mays Business School has been here. So the cyber here has been very active in encouraging faculty to participate in conferences and to do research uh, related to international business and the study of multinational enterprises. I want you to pretend you're the IRS, all right, and I'm a multinational enterprise. So I file my income tax with you. And you look at it and you say, my Lord, that looks like you haven't paid very much tax. And so the IRS decides to do an audit. So you audit me. Suppose I'm in 70 countries. I'm a multinational in 70 countries. I tell you the information about 1 70th of those countries. The other 69 are completely invisible. So the OECD has been worried about this for quite a while. Uh, they came up with something like 17 or 18 action items, and one of those action items is country by country reporting, or in short form, what we call C by CR. Multinationals are going to have to file a master file, and then it's going to have to file for every one of those 70 countries a local file. So the multinationals now know that when they file C by CR, the ability to hide goes away. So C by CR, I think, is a, a huge revolutionary change coming in the international tax system. At the very least, C by CR is going to be used as a smell test, a way for country governments to determine whether or not their countries are getting their fair share of tax. It is still true that the U.S. is the single largest market. So the percent of sales, uh, and for many of these multinationals, is here. So one of the issues is going to be whether we take advantage of this information too and decide to uh, set up a system where we tax more sales. This is coming down the road, and I think that's why uh, multinationals are so worried about C by CR.